What's going on guys? Greg North Coast Baseball Cards and today we're going to be ripping five boxes of Topps Archives snapshots. Here's what the boxes look like. These were an online exclusive on Topps.com. They were 25 bucks per box and you get one on-card autograph per box and one black and white parallel. Guys, <laughs> 25 bucks for an on on card autograph. Uh, <laughs> I think that's a good, that is a really good deal. So I got five of these. Um, it's going to have retired stars, current stars, and top rookies. So hopefully we can hit a good autograph or a couple. Um, you know, just like with any other product, there's going to be some auto less desired autographs in it. Um, in that case, you know, we're going to be seeing potentially seeing some of the same names. I remember for last year, um, Dalton Barsho followed me around everywhere. <laughs> um, that's all right. Let's, let's get into it. I think the fourth card should be our autograph. So we won't sugarcoat it. We'll get right into it. Tori Hunter. We got a Juan Gonzalez. Oh, never mind. Here's our autograph right here. So we're starting off with a Jose Canseco auto. This is an insert, and it is numbered 34 out of 50. <laughs> so off to a pretty good start. Um, yeah, I wouldn't mind hitting a Jose Canseco autograph in general. And out of a $25 product, can't go wrong with that. There's Mike Cameron, throwback. Whit Merrifield, who is on the Blue Jays now. Vidal Brujan, wouldn't mind getting his autograph. Vlad Jr., Ryan De La Cruz rookie, Reed Detmers rookie, Corbin Burns. So, all right. So, our first autograph was a Jose Canseco. <laughs> I think anyone who opens cards has probably pulled this autograph more than once. I think this is my third time in the last couple years pulling his autograph. Can't complain. Interesting guy on Twitter. <laughs> um, yeah. Very interesting guy on Twitter if you guys... Well, if you guys don't if you guys have Twitter and don't follow him, uh, you should for the entertainment. <laughs> All right, so that was the third card in the pack. Let's see if we can do that good again. We got Shan Stewart, Seth Beer. There's Zach Short, and this will be our autograph. T.J. Friedel. We got the Predator autograph. <laughs> That's what I call these. These are out of a focus. These are out of 100. As you can see in the back, I pulled Madrigal and Leode Tavares. Our black and white is Jake Myers. There's a nice Wander Franco. Put that over there. We got Cronenworth, Tyler McGill, Edward Cabrera, Josiah Gray, Corbin Burns. We got a Mike Yastrzemski. All right, box number three. So. Got Canseco Auto so far, TJ Friedel and the Predator. Uh, I don't know too much about TJ Friedel. Um, I heard his name last year, um, so I know he's definitely played a little bit, but beyond that, I wouldn't mind getting his autograph, Derek Jeter. So, all right, pack number three. Let's see who our auto is. We got Derek Jeter. Vidal Brujan, Andre Dawson, wouldn't mind getting the Hawk, and then A's, Kevin Smith, not who you're looking for, um, so there's our third autograph, don't know too much about him, got Juan Gonzalez, very small set, so you're going to see a lot of repeat names, um, Gavin Sheets, watched a couple of these get ripped on YouTube and I'm not sure um, I know I think Julio and Bobby Witt have autographs in this product but I don't know if they have cards in the base set not positive all right box number four so, so far we've gotten three of the five autos that we should be getting in the back we have Brian De La Cruz Josiah Gray, Wangan, Paul Canerico, I wouldn't mind getting his autograph, Pirates, Rodolfo Castro, 
That's a nice autograph. I'm not going to lie. That's <laughs> I'm not used to seeing uh yeah, that's a nice autograph. Looks like we have another black and white of Jaron Duran. There's Ricky Henderson, Mike Cameron, Morneau, Vlad Jr., Mount Castle, Chipper Jones. Wouldn't mind getting his autograph. But like I said, I think kind of the top names in this, they're probably hard to get. I think they're primarily loaded up with, you know, those um, rookies, you know, that <laughs> um, have a lot of time to open to sign a bunch of cards. I guess you can call them, um, in the words of oddball cards, miscellaneous rookies. All right, last pack. Let's pull a monster auto and then we'll do a quick recap. We got Vlad Jr. Shannon Stewart. There's a Shane Baz, very creepy. Let's see who we got. We got the Mets, I'm guessing Tyler Miguel. Taylor, Tyler, Taylor. Um, so that's our fifth autograph. How did he do? Uh, not too bad. Oh, there we go. Brandon Crawford, black and white. Kevin Smith. Another Wander Franco. Jaron Duran. Rome Gonzalez. Ricky Henderson. So yeah, guys, we'll do a quick recap. All right, guys, let's do a quick recap. This should be a short one since they were only five 11-pack boxes. Um, these kind of remind me of the Stranger th kind of Stranger Things uh, vibe, these, um, I guess, photo shoot? or I'm not sure exactly what they're called. Tops Focus. Tops Photo Company cards. So we got Dawson, Zach Short, Paul Canerico. I still need to get a Canerico autograph for my collection. The black and whites, we got Brandon Crawford, Jake Myers. Not one, but two, but three, <laughs> Jaron Duran, uh, black and whites. Then the base set, we hit two Wander Francos. I need to look at the base set because um, we got two or three doubles of each card, but we didn't get any Julios or Bobby Witt, so I don't know if they were in there. And then, as I call it, the Predator Parallel, um, Shane Baz rookie. So this is numbered out of 25. That's pretty cool. And I, I like this about these two, that they're all um, hand-numbered. Kind of throwback to kind of if you open any Heritage up and you get some real one autographs, those are always hand-numbered. Or the Clubhouse collection, I believe, as well. Got Kevin Smith autograph. That was their first autograph. And we got a Taylor McGill. <laughs> His autograph reminds me of when I'm uh, running late in the morning, uh, dropping my son off at daycare, and I just need to sign him in real quick. <laughs> so I just th throw something up there so I can run and get to work. That's what his uh, autograph reminds me of. And then, <laughs> yeah, big change in autographs. Look at this autograph. This is actually a really nice one. Rodolfo Castro. And then we got a Predator autograph of TJ Friedel. This is numbered out of 100, as you hand numbered. And then the hit out of, I guess the best card out of the five boxes we opened was the Jose Canseco. Um, and that is numbered out of 50. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Um, actually, I'm going to say this. Uh, very fun product to open. Uh, I would give it a 4.5 out of 5. Yeah, the collation's not good. Um, there's some, a lot of names on the checklist you don't want, but 25 bucks for a chance of hitting like a trout on card autograph. Like I highly recommend, um, I highly recommend this each year. <laughs> um, I haven't pulled anything miraculous or awesome out of it yet, but, um, I always look forward to it. I love these 25, $50, uh, products that they put out. So yeah, I highly recommend this product, um, for the future. If you guys can get your hands on it. All right. Take it easy.